Hi guys, it's Brown Sugar here. Welcome to my Thirsty Curls channel. This video is very interesting. We're going to go back in time. This is about the 19th century hair products. Cornmeal, bacon grease, kerosene oil, and cooking utensils. How black women slaves manage their hair. Thirsty Curls captures the beauty of black women with natural hair. You see, when black women slaves arrived to their destination, they did not arrive with a uh, luggage full of their favorite shampoo, conditioner, detangler, and hot rollers. They arrived with just the clothes on their backs and chains and shackles around their ankles. So it's interesting to see how these black women cope with their natural hair. See, we are talking about hair that was malnourished, dehydrated, tangled, knotted, and infected with ringworms. You see, this is a story about respect and strength, creativity, how these women were very resourceful. They found methods and techniques, tools, and their own product. her hair texture played a vital role in determining her worth and value at the auction. Calling your attention to the first item being offered for sale. Now she's a fine black pearl indeed, gentlemen. She's in fine condition. She made the entire trip above decks like a fine lady. You'll find no marks. She's young, she's supple, she's strong. Posture, boy, posture. Use it a wash, to weave, to plow, to sew, what you will. Good investment, gentlemen. Put her to it, and she'll raise you a fine litter of pickaninnies. That's enough, that's enough. But, as the whore said, turning from bottle to bed. Her hair was often used as a method of punishment to keep her in line make her feel inferior and unattractive. 